Welcome back to the channel, y'all. In this video, I told you guys we will come back and try this Phoenix scratch and swirl remover on these headlights on my Ford Explorer. Still got a little bit of roughness on these lights that I don't like. You ask me, it's like lens deterioration or something. Like, it's like when these lens take a beat down from the sun and it's starting to melt away a little. Well, I'm trying to smooth the surface out some here. And we're going to see what this Fiat Scratch and Swirl Remover do. It says it restores your car's full potential. Safely removes years of wear. Be proud of your ride. All right. It's 100% results guaranteed. So we're going to see this stuff was 10 bucks on Amazon. It comes with a crappy applicator, as I talked about <laughs> before. So in this video, I'm going to use my own applicator. But I'm just letting you guys know it comes with a crappy applicator. All right. So uh, let's see what it'll do, man. On this headlight. If I bring y'all in here, you can see, you can see it's kind of got like some roughness here. A little bit of roughness on this light. I know y'all can see it all up in here. It's like lens deterioration son. So we're going to see what can we do to anyway. way to kind of transform that. This stuff doesn't seem very, very abrasive, but maybe it is. It could be now. I'm just saying it doesn't seem like it is. Not very, very, very abrasive. Because some things you can work in and you can look down at your pad or whatever and you can see it actually pulling stuff off. I don't know how abrasive this stuff really is going to do. How it's going to pull off anything, you know. So, it's kind of hard to say. Hmm. Very little, I would say. So, we're going to go ahead and wipe that off. Y'all spoil that compound sit, so you want to go ahead and take it off. Now, um, here we go. But, seems like it looked pretty good. Still got that's a slight bit of roughness, but it looking like it's smoothing it out some much clearer than it was. I would say you can see that bulb really well in there. So, if you can see the bulb in here really, really well, then you can see out in them really, really, really well, as you can see. So, you ain't gonna have no problem driving at night, that's for sure. You'll be able to see out in them. Alright, so let's go ahead and apply another coat. Let's see what it'll do. And once again, like I said, this stuff is 10 bucks on Amazon. Comes with a crappy applicator. Um does pretty decent so far. But the lens is still, you gotta get it to your satisfaction, you know. I mean, just because it looked good, I still see some of the flaws in it. So uh, you know. I see some of the flaws, but uh, you know you can easily just sit new headlights in here for forty eight bucks on eBay too. So if y'all got that have Ford Explorers, just know when they get really fossed up, you can get new ones on eBay for forty eight dollars for two for a set. So you're looking at about, to be honest, about fifty bucks, twenty five dollars a piece basically, and it's free shipping. So. With tax and all, you're looking at about 49 to 50 bucks. So it's gonna work this in. Here we go. And basically, like I said, the only thing I'm really doing here now is trying to smooth them in some. Not really trying to clear them up. And if you guys know, the smoother you get them, the smoother you get them. The clear is gonna look and be in a way, but you got to get them, get them smooth. That's what the compound will come in there. You got to try to take them lights down smooth. It's a must. You got to get them smooth as possible. Oh, 
It's just like wet sand in a car. You know, if you don't get that car smooth, wet sand and water sand, don't get the paint slick, the body slick. If the body ain't slick, your paint ain't gonna be slick. So that's why it's important you wet sand a vehicle to get that body real slick. So your paint will be real slick. All right, so let's go ahead on and I'll pop this up. Very important. The slicker you get it, the more it's going to be clear and your paint will shine more. Same thing for your headlights. Got to get it slick. All right, as you can see here, looks pretty good. It's still got some little deterioration on the lens, but it's clear. It's clear and I think this stuff hope out pretty good. As you can see here. You'll be able to see on them pretty good still. Whether it's the clearest in the world or not. You'll be able to see on them. That's for sure. So I just want to share this with y'all. Products you can get that actually do a pretty decent job on your headlights. So um, anyway, you're new to my channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, share my videos out with your family and friends, and I like to bring you guys stuff that works, man. Till next time, we'll hit y'all on the next video. I'm out. Peace.